Hey kids, how you doing? I know you might want to check your grades and see how great you're doing in school, but you're going to want to talk to your teacher first because maybe they update grades every day. Maybe they only update them once a week. You need to know those kind of things so that way you're not checking your grades too often and getting frustrated or not checking your grades enough and then getting or falling behind on what your grades are looking like. So talk to your teacher first. Then you'll be able to go to My CNUSD. I know you know how to get there. You're simply gonna go to Student Connect. Now this is just like Parent Connect, so you're gonna be seeing the same thing your parents see, the same thing your teacher sees, so you're all gonna be able to see the same grades. You just get to log in on your own, so you don't need your parents' username or password or anything like that. You could check it whenever you're ready. Once you click that Student Connect, is going to open up on this screen. On this screen, you're simply going to log in with your same username and password that you log in to MyCNUSD, to your computer for school. So it's just your username and the password that you already knew how to get. So now, once you log in here, it's going to bring up your personal information. I can't show you a student's personal information right now, so just follow along and try to understand. So you're going to see a screen like this where it's going to show your picture, your student name, your grade, your school name. It's going to show everything right there. Now you're going to say, I can't see anything. I can't do anything. All you simply do is like you just click on it. It should be blue. Click anywhere like on your picture, your name, and then it's going to open up a little list that you can look at. You're only going to need to click on that that first time you log in. Every other time it should just show up. So you're going to have this big list right down here on the left hand side right under your picture. Now on this list, you're going to see all this stuff. You don't have to worry about any of that. But there's two things to look at. If you're only going to check your grades once a day, or just once that day, you can click pulse. Think of a pulse like, you know, your heartbeat. It changes every so often, right? So pulse is going to change once a day. Like the Student Connect system updates once a day, so your grades are updated once for that day. But let's say you check pulse, and then your teacher adds a grade and then five minutes later you check pulse again, your grade's not gonna change because like I said, it just changes once a day. So if you only check your grades you know, once for that day, pulse is fine to look at. Otherwise, you can go right to your marks and what marks is gonna do is not only show your grade, your overall grade like for math, it's gonna show you all your assignments that you've done for math. So pulse will just show you like math, A, Social studies, A. But marks will say math, A, and then show all your math assignments that you've done. So I always like looking at marks so that way I could see my grade on each individual assignment, see how I did, see if I'm missing any work, and see my overall grade. So let's see what your marks may look like. Now, again, I'm covering up the child's teacher. You may have different classes because you might be an older kid. This student doesn't get grades. They get that little O thing, right? So this is where you'll see your grade, you'll see your percent. You could also see how many times you've been absent, tardy, and missing assignments, very important. So missing assignments like show up in red, so it's really apparent when, hey, I got a missing assignment, you'll see like a red number two, and that means you have two missing assignments. So sometimes all your work doesn't show up. Like after you've been in school for a while, all your work is not gonna show up because then your list would be never ending, right? So what it's going to do, I think it shows your work for about two weeks, like just the newest two weeks of work. So if you're saying, where's all my work? I don't see it all. There's usually a little button. It doesn't show up right now because there's really no work here, but there's always a button like in the corner over here, like a little checkbox that you can check and it'll say like something like show all work. And then you click that and then it'll list all those assignments like for your whole trimester when you have like 100 assignments, you'll be able to see them all. So hopefully that makes sense. Then of course, if you ever see a mistake on your grades or you have a question about them, you're not sure, then of course you can ask your teacher and you'll be able to verify that those are your correct grades and everything is great for you. All right guys, see you later, have a good night.